Hey guys, uh, today I want to talk about strength training and how uh, doing strength training regularly can actually help you provide various health benefits and also enhance quality of your life. Now, before we get into that, let me make it very, very clear to you that strength training or weight training does not make you look like this, like this, or even remotely like this. That's purely because in order to look like this, you need to consume large amount of anabolic steroids. So as long as you're not doing that, you can never ever look like this. Weight training or strength training can help you to strengthen your skeletal system. That means stronger bones, stronger connective tissue, stronger joints. And there's a lot of study which proves that doing strength training on a regular basis can help you enhance your bone density. Then that means reduce chances of fractures, weaker bones, and it's especially good for people who are already suffering from arthritis or osteoporosis. Weight training also helps you to reduce weight or reduce your body fat. Now remember that strength training helps you to build muscle tissue. Now muscle is metabolically inactive tissue. So if you have more muscles, that means you have a faster metabolic rate and thereby it becomes much more easier for you to reduce your weight or reduce body fat. Now as the name suggests, strength training can also help you to strengthen your muscles. Now I'm not just talking about the muscles of your bicep tricep or your legs or your pectoral muscles. I'm talking about the muscles which are inside your body. For example, your cardiac muscle or your heart muscles. Now even American Heart Association says that doing strength training on a regular basis can greatly improve the efficiency of your cardiac muscles. And with so many benefits, I think it's very, very important that all of us, no matter what age group we are, all of us should incorporate strength training into our regular fitness routine. Yes, it's very important that you need to do strength training like strength training. As the name suggests, that you have to apply strength. That means if you're lifting 2 kg weight and you're going to do it for nearby, let's say, 20-25 uh, repetitions, that's not going to provide you any benefits of strength training. As a thumb rule, you should try and lift weight for nearby 10 to 12 reps per set. Now, if you think that with the same weight, you can do 13th, 14th, 15th repetition, that means you're not really lifting heavy enough and it's time for you to increase your weight on the barbell or on the dumbbell. Now, I'm not saying that you should only do strength training. Uh, if your idea is overall fitness, then you should hit all aspects of fitness, which is uh, cardiovascular endurance, which is about running, jogging, uh, which helps you to enhance your cardiovascular endurance. Uh, number two is strength training, what we discussed about right now. Number three, flexibility, uh, which is very important to reduce your chances of injury. So it's very, very important that you should do flexibility on a regular basis. And number four is uh, body composition, which is about reducing your body fat levels and enhancing your muscle tissue, which will happen with the help of these three factors, which is your strength training, cardio and flexibility. And the fourth most important factor, which is your nutrition. All right, guys, so that was pretty much it. And uh, if you like to watch more videos, then you can check out my website, which is uh, www.excelfitness.co.in. Uh, if you have any questions, if you have any queries, you can always write to me at raghav.pande at excelfitness.co.in. I'm going to see you guys next time. Till then for me. Bye-bye.